Thanks for coming back to our channel. This particular video is part of our playlist called Learn English Slang. It is dedicated to helping you improve your understanding and use of English slang and interesting expressions. Today we are going to learn about a very popular slang expression. You will find it in both formal and informal contexts and is easily one of the most used expressions in the English language. Today's slang expression is up to snuff. Up to snuff is an adjective phrase that describes something as reaching an acceptable or usual standard or being of passable quality. The phrase is usually used in the context of an expected standard being met. It's often used in negative constructions to indicate that something is not meeting such a standard and is of poor quality. Here is an example, the quality of this restaurant simply hasn't been up to snuff lately. The food is not hot enough, and the presentation is terrible. Here's another example from a CNN news report in 2021. Theranos was already sending blood tests to third-party vendors using traditional blood diagnostic analysis, because its own technology was not up to snuff. Here's a typical example most can recognize, my old computer is taking forever to boot. It simply isn't up to snuff. I will need to buy a new one. Even when used positively, the phrase typically means about the same thing as satisfactory or adequate, indicating that a standard or expectation has been met but not exceeded. So, where does the expression, up to snuff, come from? In fact, it can be traced back to the 18th century. One of the earliest uses of up to snuff comes from Hamlet Travesty, from 1810 by playwright John Poole. In this humorous version of Shakespeare's Hamlet, Poole uses the phrase up to snuff to describe Hamlet as being clever and sharp-witted. Originally, the phrase up to snuff was used to describe someone as being mentally sharp, someone who's not easy to fool. The phrase is thought to have used the word snuff in reference to a form of tobacco that was sniffed through the nose. This snuff was thought to heighten a person's senses and make them more perceptive. It's unclear how or exactly when the meaning of up to snuff evolved to describe something as being of acceptable quality. It's likely that the modern sense is simply a more general usage of the older sense, as a person who was described as up to snuff would be competent enough to perform a task. That wraps it up for today's video. Thank you very much for finding the time to watch today's lesson. If this video provided you with some value, do consider helping us. Subscribe, give a like and hit that notification button. This way you will never miss another video from us. Take care and see you in the next one.